It's nice to be back here. I've been here before in 2004. I was a writer for uh, another movie. It was Bridal Shower, directed by Jeffrey Gitorian. And uh, it's nice to be invited again because I think most of the films that I've written were, were shown here, uh, like Bridal Shower, uh, Caregiver, I think, uh, Sukob, uh, Kimidora, which I also wrote. Uh, so it's a kind of a very uh, welcome experience to be coming back to the first ever festival I've been to. Talaga? Yes. First? First. But not as a director. Not as a director, sorry. It's right. my first time here in Udine. It's lovely. Yes, I want to be back. Seriously. <laughs> not joking. And I know I will be back. It was a very good uh, screening with a very enthusiastic audience. Uh, at first I was nervous because uh, I didn't know if the audience will get it, but I think they got it because they were laughing at the right time and more. <laughs> so we were very accelerated last night. I was not expecting anything, but I was hoping that the audience will get it because uh, there are some similarities with our culture and uh, especially uh, about marriage, about wedding, about ceremonies, you know, us being a, a Catholic country. And uh, I think it's quite relatable about, about having a godmother, about giving away the bride, you know, about having a perfect wedding. So I think there's something there that's common between uh, us Filipinos and Italians. So uh, the, the situation is very relatable. Uh, it's a very universal uh, situation, uh, so I was, but I didn't expect that they will they will be getting all the jokes. So uh, that made me very satisfied last night. I had uh, my mentor Armando Lau, who is a well-respected uh, screenwriter in the Philippines. So we worked on the concept together. We wanted to do uh, a commercial project for our producer, Joji Alonso, who is an independent uh, film producer. And we brainstormed on the project, and we uh, first started with the idea of doing a film about soul swapping or body swapping. And then um, we listed down the things that Filipinos uh, would dream about, you know, so we listen around five or four, so that's uh, fortune, beauty, youth, sex, love, and then we assign that to characters. And then um, I said, uh, are you sure we're going to have five characters uh, swapping uh, souls? Because this has been done before, I mean, uh, the concept of body swapping has been with us for the longest time, but I think it's the first time that five people uh, have actually swapped. Uh, so, so it's really more complicated. So we really upped the ante and uh, made it even more difficult for us. So that's where it started. So it's about uh, wish fulfillment. It's about wanting the things that we don't have. It's about contentment. It's about uh, our dreams. If you have seen Kimidora, it was... Uh, I played twins, right? And in this film, of course, the director, Chris Martinez, we had a workshop and then we list down the characteristics of, uh, uh, of the first, the original character, and then we talk to the actor who will play the body that you will get, the possessed body, and then you compare and then you help each other. So you will establish first your original character and then you pass it on. You pass it on. So uh, they really work closely together to build a character because each character, each actress, each actor plays two roles and each role they share with another actor. Mm -hmm. I think the, the, the core of the four characters uh, speaks uh, v about very real problems which are not just um, problems that Filipinos experience, it's, these are very universal problems. The only person who didn't have a problem was the bride. The bride. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's living the perfect life, mm -hmm. but she had the biggest problem in the end, right, when everybody seemed to be more comfortable inside the body of another person. So I think that's the, the twist in the, in, the, in, the, in the story. I'm shooting two films right now, but this is a break. So 
when I uh, return, I'll be finishing Ang Baba is a Septic Tank. It's another entry for the Cinemalaya. And uh, he wrote it. And uh, I think it's going to be shown here. <laughs> <laughs> I think. <laughs> And another one, I'm doing a mainstream film for Star Cinema, um, the same company that produced uh, Here Comes the Bride. Um, there I'm not playing a bride or uh, a bride wannabe. I am a wife uh, wanting a divorce, an annulment. So it's very interesting also. In uh, Ang Baba is a septic tank, uh, which means the woman in the septic tank, uh, she'll be playing herself. There's a, a yeah, somehow there's Eugene Domingo as herself, and then wow. after that, she will be doing the sequel to. I'll be doing which she wrote again. Finally, <laughs> thank you. The sequel to Kimidora. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So she'll be doing that. Those and then skills. maybe I'll get pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> you have to find a husband first. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, I can do it! I can do it! That's why! Thank you, I'll do that!